In this video, we examine the speed differences between Turbocad Pro 16 and version 17. We start by creating a drawing in Turbocad 17 with 100,000 single lines. We firstly use the line tool to create a single line that is one inch long. We then select the line and do a radial copy of 1000 lines. As you can see, appears in a circular shape. We then use the block tool to help us duplicate the block. Blocks are referred to as single entities in TurboCAD and resultantly speed up the copying procedures. The blocks can be easily dragged and dropped from the block palette. Once the blocks have been copied, they can then be selected and exploded to break the block into individual lines. The number of lines can be seen in the selection info palette. In this example, we will be using a drawing with 100,000 lines. We will be using the special draw testing palette to automate some redraw procedures. In this case, you can see the automated testing is running 10 versions of a procedure that rotates the X view. As you can see, it takes well over 20 seconds. TurboCAD will restart when we switch the new native draw Redway SDK option, which allows us to make use of the graphics acceleration card. When the new drawing is loaded, you can see that the results are virtually instantaneous with when we run multiple tests. So as we can see, TurboCAD version 17 has a dramatic speed improvement in the area of zooming, panning and working within the drawing. However, a word of caution when opening drawings in version 17 as this appears to take significantly longer in the new version. This also applies to switching between paper space and model space. CAD Core specializes in TurboCAD training. We have a wide range of training movies as well as offer one-on-one -on -one training services in online meetings. Call us now toll-free on 1-877-827-8776 to evaluate your training needs. 